Hello and welcome to Projects in Java. Today we're going to finish our text editor project. We're going to work on our last class, the editor class. So let's go to our project. Let's create a new class. And we'll call this editor. So again, we're going to extend JPanel and implement action listener. Here we're going to have a file called file, two J buttons, one to save. And another to save and close. We're also going to have a text area called text. And we'll make this 20 by 40. Now we'll create our default constructor. And that's going to take a string argument. And we'll make file equal to new file with that string argument. We'll add the action listeners to save and save.close. And before we continue, let's add the action listeners back in file browser. So here, new file dot add action listener. And We'll pass it this and open dot add action listener this okay now back to our editor class so now if the file exists we need to copy the existing text So we'll have a buffered reader, call this input equals new buffered reader. And pass that new file reader with file. and surround that with a try and catch. And we'll do the same thing we did earlier. So string line is equal to input dot read line. And while line does not equal null, Well, we'll append to the text, so text.append line plus a new line character. And line is equal to input.readLine. And then we'll add the buttons and the text area to this. So add save 
Add save C. And add text. And in the action perform method, we're going to create a file writer. Now let's go back up here and make sure we close our input. So input.close. We'll close that before we call the writer. We're going to call out.write text.get text. And we'll surround this with the try and catch. And then we'll close the file writer. And if the source, so e.get source is equal to save C, we're going to close. And so here we'll do the same thing that we did in our other classes login, login. It's equal to cast login to get parent. And then login.cl.show, login, and we'll pass this FB. And so before we test this, I just need to make a change in file browser. So we need to add these editors to the login. Now let's run this. Let's log in with the user we created. And we have file one. So let's open file one. And we can save it. Then save and close. And so now let's check our folder. So our user one folder, open up the file. And here's the text that we input. Let's open it again. And here's that text. So now let's try to create a new file. So file 2. And file 2 test. Save and close. And here's our second file right here. And if we close and relaunch. We can see our second file right here. And we can open that up. And this completes our text editor project. Of course, you can add to it more if you like. Uh, and I hope to see you in future videos.